Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for around the 3rd, around April 3rd. So, we're just going to see what comes up. What are we in? But you know the timing is fluid, and you know i got to say that a lot because a lot of people don't get it. But anyhow, uh, what do we got for a message today? What kind of message do I have for today? Ooh, looks like somebody's being carried away. I know a lot of people don't want to hear that, but that looks like that is the case. All right. You know, you may hear some news that somebody that you know has passed away. That's what it looks like to me. Or somebody could be taken to a hospital. I mean, it could be, it could go, I mean, this person could be getting in an ambulance. They could be going to a hospital, okay? <clears throat> this looks like it's a very grim situation. I mean, it looks like there's, it looks like, I mean, this guy's, uh, there's no more communication. It's over. It looks like something, it's done. Yeah, the sword is down. Uh, there's no power left. It's powerless. Somebody's lost their power. Or look, at, it looks to me like it's too late. Okay, it looks to me like it's too late. Um, there's no coming back from this. It looks like there's no coming back. And I, I mean, I got to be honest with you. I mean, I'll get. I'm sure that I'll get a comment below. This is how can you give a negative reading like that? Do you? Is it a positive time right now? Let's be realistic, please. I'm not going to make something up. This does not look good. Okay, this is a this is a death. This is losing stability, losing security, insecure. This is somebody not being realistic, not being responsible, making poor decisions. Yeah, it doesn't look good. It does not look good at all. This looks as though somebody is being uh, you know, it's a dire situation but in for lack of a better word, it's it's, it's a definitely a dire situation. This person uh that 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 it's happening to uh, was was uh, probably a bully. This person was a bully. This person was uh, a financial mess anyway. They were probably driven by greed. They were mer very materialistic, whoever this person is that is, is being taken away. Okay, this, pers this person was selfish. Um, wanted to live the high life. Uh... Chose the high life, chose money over everything. This person was a, was a, a, a very selfish, spendy, uh, materialistic uh, person that put money before everything. Okay, this person, money was their top priority. So whoever this person is that is, is being taken away was money hungry. That's what they, that was their main source of, 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 uh, energy, you know, or food or whatever. All they cared about was money, 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 money. That is the person that is, uh, being, it's over for that person. That's who we're talking about. We're talking about this greedy, selfish individual who only cared about money. Oh my God. Not about love. Okay. I already knew this. All right. The 10 of cups reverse. This person didn't, didn't focus on their family. Didn't focus on a relationship. They focused more on, uh, materialistic things. They didn't even have time for their family, you know? So, or their relationship, they just didn't have time for it. And now this is, this is, uh, parting ways. There is definitely somebody here that is parting ways. 
they are parting ways from their family okay so I feel like this must be some sort of family member or something um, and I'm sorry I am sorry get prepared get prepared this uh, somebody's ship is, is sailing it's saying goodbye you know this is this is this is saying goodbye bye saying goodbye some it is you notice he's waving saying goodbye somebody's ship has sailed and this is getting on a somebody's ship i mean they're getting you see all the water okay so somebody is like getting on the ship they're, and it's the ship that sails away okay so and that's saying goodbye so that's just saying goodbye so somebody is saying goodbye they're going to be saying goodbye to somebody i feel like this person uh was probably ill they were getting sicker and sicker and sicker, and they just couldn't come back. Um, so but I think that you, you you may be saying goodbye. You may be saying goodbye to somebody. Um, there's no and this and if this isn't an actual death, this could be um, the death of a relationship. Okay, because we do have a relationship here where there's relationship problems. Uh, there's no love here. We have somebody here that may have been in any loveless relationship. And they may have been in that relationship just for financial reasons, okay? Um, but this is 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 leaving. This is definitely leaving. Somebody is leaving the re leaving a relationship. Um, it is. I mean, I can't. It is what it is. Whether they are whether they are passing away or uh, or actually, you know deciding to go there's some you could just be deciding to go they could be getting some help because it looks like we got some some help here okay there is some sort of there's 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 help okay uh, this person has reached rock bottom you know and maybe it's a near-death experience it could be a near-death experience but this looks grim i mean this guy looks very it looks very very grim it looks like it's too late to me but that's what it looks like. I feel like it's too late. It's already happened. It, it's like the, this is happened. It's already happened. It's too late. Now it's time to uh, say goodbye. It's time to say goodbye. So that's what I feel like this is. Um, so it's probably going to be very, a very, very, very emotional time. Okay, this is this is highly emotional. I feel like um, it's it's going to be hard. It's going to be hard to master emotions. It's going to be very disappointing. There could be some heartbreak, some deep sadness. I mean, I can't pretend and I'm not going to. So, yeah, it's a very sad time. It is. It is. It's a sad time. Okay? It's a sad time. But this relationship appears to be have been based on materialism. This person was very shallow, very uh, superficial, very materialistic, uh, really focused on appearances. Now there's definitely going to be a loss. Okay, two of pentacles reverse this person. Uh, there's the ship again. The ship is sailing away. There is no doubt about it. This is this is chaos. This is uh, falling down, losing balance. Somebody may lose their balance. They may hit the ground. Um, and this is just being let go. These people have come. These people have come to take this person away. They have. We have somebody here that bit off more than they can chew. They did. They had too many balls in the air. They were overwhelmed. They were trying to do too much, trying to prove themselves, right? I mean, this guy is a juggler. It's all about getting a profit, trying to have as much as they can have, you know, instead of just is instead of just concentrating on one thing, trying to concentrate on more than one thing. This is somebody who made a poor decision, and it was poor financial decisions. This person, I think this, this is such a money-hungry individual. It really is. That's what I'm getting from this person. This person um, is going to, it's like they're we have a very selfish individual here. Um who is about to experience a financial loss. And maybe it's because of their partner. Maybe their partner is leaving.
somebody is, it feels like this individual that is leaving is losing their balance or they're losing money or they, there's something that happens. This relationship wasn't on the same page for quite some time, I believe. I think things were getting worse. This per, Somebody wasn't able to balance out the relationship in their job or their money and love or something like that. It was, it was very difficult to handle both. Now they're losing something. What the hell? Ah, yes, there's going to be some, some grieving. This is grieving. This person's drowning and not doing anything about it, just letting it happen. So it feels as though, I mean, this one's asking for help and this one doesn't care. I don't have anything left. I don't have anything left. Just, just, it's too late. It's too late. So, yes, it is. It's too late. It's like just, uh, I can't help you. I can't help you. Um. This person is very much, uh, we have depression here, uh, very, very depressed. Wanting to protect themselves, trying, only cares about themselves. All I care about is myself right now. Can't see clearly. We have somebody here that is very selfish. We do. This person is selfish. Unwilling to help. Maybe, I don't know if we're dealing with a water sign. This is water, water, water. We could be dealing with a water sign that's just unwilling to help. Go ahead. I don't care. I don't care if you die. That kind of thing. I don't care if you leave. Go ahead and leave. Somebody may be saying that. Go ahead and leave. This person has been asking for help. And the other person is like, no, I'm not going to help you. And maybe it's financial assistance. Somebody may be need, need a financial assistance. And, the, and it's like, no, too bad. So we, I think we have a very selfish individual here. I do I think we have a selfish individual that is about to experience a big loss. What goes around, comes around. What goes around, comes around. Okay. So... Uh, I think it's going to be a very, very, very emotional time. Um, it's too late. I just want to keep saying it's too late. It's too late. You can't fix the relationship now. The relationship is unfixable. It's unfixable. This person, the Queen of Cups in reversed, is, is very revengeful. She's shallow. No offense to you, Queen of Cups. This could be anybody. This is a, this is a, somebody that is jealous. She's shallow. She's self-loathing. She's clingy. She's needy. She's hypersensitive. That enough drives somebody crazy. Cries all the time. Whines. Bitches. So, anyhow, um, saying goodbye. Somebody is saying goodbye and letting somebody go. It's just go, see ya. Seriously, this is what this is. This is goodbye. Good riddance. Oh, my God. So, something is ending. Something is ending. I think that somebody's held on as long as they can hold on. It feels like somebody is dying and the person that they are with, and it could be the end of a relationship, okay? Um, death is an ending, okay? Whether it's an actual physical death or it's an internal one or it's a death of a situation, something is dying, okay? If there's been a delay, I feel like this could be uh, something that happens where I feel like it's all of a sudden, all of a sudden, um, somebody gives up. It's like they just give up. Um, yes, it is. It's giving up. They've been waiting. They've been waiting for this to end. They've been waiting for the moment. Well, now the moment has come. Okay. This is a disaster. Okay, the death reversed. This is a disaster. This is an accident or an incident that causes, uh, could be even an emotional outburst. I think we talked about this yesterday because the Queen of Cups can definitely, like I said, she can have an emotional outburst. Um, 
there's been a delay, but I guess now it's too late. It's just like, you know what? It's really, really, really time to go. It really is time to go. There is definitely somebody that is leaving. They are leaving. They have made their decision. I think it's a sad time. I think it's sad. I think it's sad. I feel like this person has some sort of regrets. Um, whoever is leaving, I think that they know that it's over. They know that it's too late. They have some regrets and it's time to go. I think they're not happy about it, but they're leaving just as, just as well. It's not good news, put it that way. It's not good news. I feel like somebody is... Um, We have an end of a relationship here. There's a split, okay? There is. There is. There is. There's a split. It's like I don't care anymore. Bye. Good luck.